If you suffer cataracts, you're not alone. In fact, there are nearly 24.5 million of us in the United States who do, according to the American Academy of Ophthalmology. It's the leading cause of vision impairment in the States, and surgery remains the most effective way to treat it. But what about the care after the surgery? Well, here to discuss an innovative new method of post-surgical care is one of the leading cataract surgeons in the country, and he's also an internationally recognized expert, Dr. Eric Donenfeld. It's great having you, doctor. Thanks for being here I, with you. I appreciate it. Uh, it's really great to have you. Well, let's talk about this. The future landscape of, of, of post-operative treatment, inflammation of the eye. This can be a little bit more of a, uh, of a troubling thing up until this point, but new technology is making it a little better. You're absolutely right. And, uh, you know, there are 4 million cataracts done in the United States on an annual basis. That's a lot of cataracts. Yeah. And one of the... Um, issues that a lot of patients have that you may think may be trivial but is actually very significant is that patients just don't take their eye drops. Yeah. A lot of the patients just have problems getting their medicines into their eye and if you do a perfect cataract surgery and you don't take the medicines the right way, it can cause inflammation that can cause complications that can really ruin a perfectly performed procedure. Wow, yeah, of course you don't want to do that. The worst thing about going under the knife once is going under the knife twice. So what are the biggest challenges then? How do, how do we get these eye drops into the eyes correctly? Is there a new method to be able to do this? Well, the first of all is the challenge. The challenge is that uh, a lot of patients are older. They're 70, 80, 90 years of age, and they just don't have the ability or the manual dexterity to put the drops into their eyes. Right. They don't have uh, uh, the ability to do it. They may have arthritis. Yeah. They could have Parkinson's disease. Yeah. Sometimes they just forget to take their medications or they take them incorrectly. So the unmet need that we've been looking at for the last you know, 20, 25 years is how can we get patients the medicines in a better way? Mm -hmm. And that's what makes this new innovation so exciting. So exactly how is that done then with this new, uh, with this new method? Well, the new medication is called DexaQ, and what it is, it's a corticosteroid, which is an anti-inflammatory that reduces the inflammation after surgery, and it promotes healing. And instead of using it in a drop form by the patient, the doctor actually puts it inside the eye ah. during the operation, so the medicine is given to them automatically, and it dissolves over about three weeks of time, so the patient gets around the clock, 24-hour drug delivery, and it tapers off all by itself. See, now that's incredible. And so this is a slow dissolving method over, the, over nearly a month. You don't have to worry about the eye drops anymore. That's very, that's nice. The less we have to think, the better, doctor. This is, uh, that's, that's, that's what I'm looking forward to. Uh, speaking of, uh, not, I, I'm not I'm looking forward to having a cataract, but what age is the average age for cataract surgery? The average age is in the uh, early 70s, yeah. but the older you get, the more common they are. And uh, again, we're seeing more and more cataract surgery. As a matter of fact, over the next couple of years, we expect cataract surgery to double here in the United States. No kidding. Is there a particular reason why cataracts appear? Well, uh, number one reason is that the population is getting older. The baby boomers are yeah. entering that prime age for cataract surgery. That's true. Uh, number two is because the operation has become so successful, Patients like having surgery done because it basically gives them better, better vision. So they're having it done earlier and earlier, where in the old days we used to wait until the patient couldn't function. Now we're doing it at an earlier stage when it improves their ability to see. Uh, and a lot of times with new intraocular lenses, you can actually see far away without glasses and see up close. So for some patients, cataract surgery really becomes the fountain of youth. That's really uh, incredible stuff. If we want to learn more about this uh, innovative new eye uh, treatment method, wh where do we go? Well, go to the website, uh, Dexacu, D-E-X-Y-C-U dot com, and you'll get the full prescribing information that you need. Doctor, pleasure. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right, Take if you'd care. Like, if you'd like to learn more about this new pet method of post-surgical care for cataracts, it seems to be a lot simpler as well. Head to our website on your screen. iPoint Phar Pharmaceuticals is a proud sponsor of The Morning Blend.